It was a big day for some big animals and little kids in De Beer. Fox 11's Robert Hornacek has more on the Youth Livestock Show. If you aren't familiar with raising livestock, you may not appreciate all the work that's done to get to this point, even for people like six-year-old Max Larson. I have to walk them, feed them, and give them water. Max is one of the youngest participants at the Northeast Youth Livestock Show at the Brown County Fairgrounds. 19-year-old Tina Holst, one of the most experienced. I love working with animals. I have dogs too. It's just, it's something about them. They all have a personality. They're a lot of fun. Holst is in her ninth year of showing pigs. She says it teaches kids about responsibility. We have to feed them morning and night. We slap them to gain weight. And we walked her, I walked her about two miles a day probably. Organizers say events like this also teach kids business skills. You can show them in a book what the costs are and everything, but here they get the chance where they purchase the animal, they purchase the feed, they all their supplies that they need for the animal, then they see what their expenses, and then they try to sell it here to see what they're going to get for income on the end of it. After the weekend competition, the animals will be auctioned off. That's not always easy for people who put in so much time with the animals. It's really hard for the young, the youth. Um, I've seen a lot of tears shed. I've, I've shed a lot myself over the years, but you get used to it. In the end, Holst says it's worth it because kids get some valuable lessons. In De Pere, Robert Hornichak, Fox 11 News. By the way, that livestock auction will be held tomorrow from 9.30 in the morning to 1 in the afternoon at the Brown County Fairgrounds.